What's up guys, Will H back with another video taking a look at a ceramic heater that we picked up for my home. We're expecting some very cold temperatures here in the next few days in Louisiana where I live at. And that is not normal for us to be this cold. So in my house, I have a couple of these already, but in my house, I have a, a couple of rooms or a few places where it always seems to be a little bit colder than other places in the house. So we we have a few of these, a couple of these already, and we're going to use this one in another spot like that as well. So uh, this is by the company DeLong High, if I'm pronouncing that right. I know I'm butchering it. We got it from Lowe's, I think, and I will leave the, li the link and the price on the display here. Uh, this is for a full room, 1500 watts, ceramic heater. Some of the other features, it has the safety off. Uh, switch of mechanism there safety feature automatically switches the heater off in the event of the an accidental over tip you're going to have the motorized swing the oscillating feature provides a wide range of airflow distribution and then eco automatically adjusts the heat and power settings for most comfortable and ergonomic warmth you're also going to get a three-year warranty uh, on this device as well and then this side of it you just got a nice picture of the device some scenarios where you can use it here it looks like and then it gives you another breakdown back here of it number one you got the digital thermostat you're gonna have your eco function uh, right there number three two power settings number four summer ventilation number five remote control and then you got your swing, motorized swing. So it's nice it comes with a remote control as well. And then this side, talking about the digital control, you got a 24 hour timer as well. And then some other stuff there, but that is the breakdown on this. Let's go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and get it out of the box. And then we'll take a closer look and see how you know see how it looks all right guys so we back in this is everything that was in the packaging you're going to get all your paperwork here you get some safety uh tips here different languages you're also going to have some more paperwork here and then you got your operations manual here it's going to give you a lot of good information so it's going to break it down the button functions on the remote control as well as the uh heater Let's go ahead and see if we can show both of these at the same time. If I can situate this, if not, well, we'll just break it down like this. So A, which is over here on the remote and the uh, heater, it's gonna be your on and off. B, it's gonna be your adjustment buttons. You got your oscillating button, eco function button, timer, mode button, power indicator. So that is that. You also got your remote control, which is nice and tiny and small. You guys see your power button, your minus and plus, lower and raise your temperature, your mode button, eco button, timer, and isolating button. Of course, it has a branding right there as well. This does have a battery in it as well. So uh, you got some branding here on the bottom. You got your safety tip over switch in case it uh, tips over. You're also going to have your two heater strips here on the front of it. And then the top, you're going to have your up and down, which is to lower and raise your temperature, your mode button, your off on button, your timer, eco, and your oscillating button there. On the back of it here, it says do not cover right there. You got, do have a Karen handle ventilated back here. And this is going to be cold to the touch, so you don't have to worry about burning your hand there. Then, of course, you got your power cord as well. So we're going to go ahead and plug this in and try it out. All right, guys, so we're back in. I have the remote control and also the heater plugged in. Now, the power cord on there is about four to five feet long. I forgot to mention that. So every function that's on the remote control is here. So let's go ahead and turn the power on. So there's the power. You see the LED, so if you turn the power back off, it's gonna give you a countdown uh, for about six seconds, and then it turns the unit off right there. 
So we're gonna go ahead and turn it back on. And everything that's on the remote control is here. I'm just gonna go ahead and show you the functions here. So right now, uh, we're gonna go through the modes. So this mode right here, when you see this little emblem right there, like a fan, that is gonna be your inner ventilation mode. And this operating mode, only the fan operates. So no heat is coming out of the device right there. So, all right, the next mode, so this is going to be your anti-freeze mode. In this operating mode, the appliance keeps the room at a temperature of 45 degrees to for prevent freezing temperatures. So that's what this mode is. So the next mode is going to be heat one and two. So heat one is the minimum power level. So basically, like you got a high and a low. So one is going to be low and two is going to be high right there. So I can adjust the temperature with the minus and plus, set it wherever I want, you know, up and down right there. And that's how that goes. So uh, those are all of the modes right there. Uh, next, you're gonna have your timer. So this is a 24 hour timer. I can set it to wherever I want. That's the timing mode right there. Next, we're gonna have our eco button here. Let's go ahead and press that. So in the eco mode, uh, in this operating mode, the appliance will automatically set the power level to guarantee the best comfort, reducing the energy consumption. Uh, in this operating mode, the unit may switch the heating power level from maximum to minimum or vice versa. Several times in an hour when using this eco function, the minimum temperature, maximum temperature setting is 79. So that is the eco button there. And turn that off and then the ice oscillating is here now there's only one speed with the oscillating so it's not going to be uh, you can't speed it up to make it oscillate faster but that is that button there and I can tell you guys that it is getting pretty warm right here I'm pretty close to it I, I'll put some more b-roll in here and let you guys see uh, how tall this is what you're going to look for it's not it's not a very big unit there it is oscillating there and uh, the remote control works the same way it works great uh, let's go ahead and stop that so no issues I can go through the different modes here just by pressing the button turn it off as you guys see turn it back on and let me demonstrate the safety switch. So if a kid or someone knocks this over, it's gonna turn it off. As you guys see that little switch I showed you guys in the back turns it off. It will not turn back on until you turn it on right there. Uh, the grill's a little bit warm, uh, but yeah, that's it guys. So this is the, the Long High Ceramic Heater. Uh, I'll drop a link in the description if you guys want to pick this up. Will H. Gadgets and more. I'm out.